Bachelor breakup. Chris and Whitney calling it quits just after two months after the Bachelor finale and ABC's Lindsay Davis has the story. Their romance blossoming in front of an audience of millions on The Bachelor. Will you accept this rose? But now, just seven months after this rustic proposal... Will you marry me? <sighs> Absolutely. Turns out there won't be a happily ever after for Iowa-based Prince Farming, Chris Souls, and big city fertility nurse Whitney Bischoff. In reality, they were never really in the same city for that long. They have very different lives, and that might have all proven to be too much of a strain on the relationship. If you think their story ended fast, you're not wrong, but they're not alone. Will you marry me? Jason Mesnick famously breaking things off with Melissa Rycroft in a live TV special moments after his proposal aired in the season finale. Remember Juan Pablo? He didn't even propose to Nikki Farrell, just offered these words. I like you a lot. But the romance with the shortest running time, Brad Womack, who didn't pick anyone. In fact, after nearly 30 seasons of the show, only four couples have actually made it down the aisle. For the most part, these relationships end either, you know, a week to six months after the show finale airs. Whitney recently shared with me the stress of dating post-reality show. You know, being in hiding and we had like secret weekends that they would set up for you, um, but those goodbyes were always really, really tough. But all hope isn't lost for those hoping to find true love on TV. After 12 years and two kids, the first ever bachelorette Trista and hubby Ryan Sutter still going strong. For Good Morning America, Lindsay Davis, ABC News, New York.